Hey everyone, this is Buffalo Picker coming at you with another video. I wanted to make this quick sourcing video of the items that I picked up from Burlington on Friday and some of the items that I picked up from the Walmart clearance on Saturday. I have everything broken down on the table behind me. Um, I'm excited about the deal, especially from the uh, Burlington location. I was one of the first to be there in line uh, to get into the store. So I got some good deals. Um, but before I get into that, uh, today is Memorial Day and I wanna definitely give a shout out to the fallen, uh, the service members that uh, made the ultimate sacrifice and to their families that they left behind. Uh, being a military retiree serving in two wars and one conflict, I can say that I am truly blessed to be here. Uh, from 2001 to 2005, I was deployed seven times to the war zone. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did the Buffalo say seven? Yes, seven times. So at this time, I wanna give a salute to those who sacrificed their life for us to still be here and enjoy this freedom. I was one of the first in line, actually the second person in line. And um, I got up at five o'clock, got over to the store that didn't actually open to 10. So I was super early, but when it was time for those doors to uh, open, I mean, it was well worth the sacrifice to not have to wait in line. Uh, I actually gave up my chair uh, once, you know, I was close to the store opening, I went towards the back to uh, ask anybody if they need a fold chair. And uh, this older lady uh, said that she would take the chair. And I glanced at the line. The line was wrapped around the store. So yeah, uh, in the beginning, I was like, man, you got up too early. But you know, at the end, I was like cheering on the inside, like, yeah, you know, you, you was one of the first to get in the store. So uh, the unfortunate thing, yo, and if your store haven't opened yet, I mean, uh, you know, be prepared that what Burlington does is they allow their cus their uh, employees to shop first. No, 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 oh, no. So uh, you will see if you get that early enough, you will see uh, people coming in, employees coming coming in from other locations and they are shopping you know you come in and the first thing i saw was people that i seen coming into the store early uh going over cashing out and then they was pretty much helping assist in the store so i mean you know that's that's just the way the cookie crumbles from the school of hard knock that's what i'm talking about school of hard knock Liz. so i mean i i, I just couldn't focus on that I, i'm just saying that it does happen, but when you get in that store, you know, just focus on the positive. Go get what you need and, um, you know, try to get things that you can flip. And my first uh, initiative was to get in the store, run over to toys, get all the toys that I can get. And I got to toys and I was disappointed. Man, are you serious? I mean, this was the uh, third Burlington that I had been in since the reopening. This particular Burlington, they opened late. So they had a late opening. Uh, other Burlington's opened like two weeks ago, and this one opened up on Friday. And, um, you know, but most of the toys was gone. I mean, I got more toys in the other Burlington's than I did this Burlington. I was the first in you know, on the grand reopening. But, um, you know, one thing as a reseller, uh, you definitely, you gotta adjust. I mean, you cannot run into a roadblock and just stop like, you know, well, I didn't find any toys, you know, I gotta put my head down and leave the store. No, 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 I'm not doing that. 
I mean, and let that be a lesson to anybody out there. You have to adjust. The key word is perseverance. You know, you run into a roadblock, don't let it stop you. Find a way, figure out something else to do. And that's what I did. I went over to the baby section, which I really don't like uh, going into the baby section because, you know, it's like uh, I didn't really know what I could find in there. But as a reseller, especially on Amazon, you know you got to use that seller's app. You know, so I got that seller app and I got it out and I made it work. And I found items in the baby section that opened my eyes to like, whoa, you've been coming in the store, passing over this stuff. Even at regular price, you still can make good money off of it. So uh, super excited for the 50 percent off at Burlington. You know, I get them, um, you know, uh, kudos for you know, open up the doors to resellers and other people that just, you know, trying to buy stuff to maybe improve their wardrobe or improve things that they have in their home or, you know, gifts or whatever the case may be. Um, but yeah, I had the whole baby section to myself and I tried to clean up on everything that I could flip, uh, for my money. So, uh, with that being said, I'm definitely going to go over and show you all everything i may not be able to comp everything but i'm going to show you everything i got from burlington and i'm going to show you everything that i got from walmart clearance and i may show you a couple of my shelves that i have here i don't quite have everything in order like i want it yet uh but i might do a little preview give you all a little preview of the place uh well i'll say a small preview of uh area in the place because i want to get it you know uh up the par before I start showing off my little uh, storage slash garage place. But anyway, let me get to it. I'm gonna show you these items, and uh, you know, hopefully, you see something at your local uh, Burlington that you can buy. And if your stores haven't opened yet, maybe this is just a preview of what you need to look for. A word of caution: if you are a Amazon seller, don't run out and buy everything you see without scanning it, please. Uh, don't get caught up in the hype. Uh, you, you know how Amazon work. You only ungated in certain things, and sometimes they ungate you in a few items in a category, but you may not be ungated in that brand. So make sure you pay attention to the app. You know, understand what the app is, the seller app is telling you before you run out and buy this stuff. Okay, so we're going to start out with the uh, Star Wars uh, Yoda helmets, uh, fake mask, yeah, electronic mask. Uh, these items was uh, marked down to uh, $9.99, so um, half of that I rounded up to $5. So I got two of those. And this basically was the good stuff uh, in toys. I mean, so you can see what I had you know, to basically try to get. I bought, uh, purchased these uh, puzzles. This is the Harry Potter. Uh, what was the price on this one? This was marked down at $2.99. So I basically got this for $1.50. And I purchased two of those. And then I got this other um, thousand piece puzzle, which is the Raven uh, Burger. Raven's Burger puzzle, 1,000 piece. I got a uh, two or three of those, and they was marked down. This one was marked down to four ninety nine, so it was fifty percent off of that. And um, I got the Last Supper uh, puzzle. Um, that one was nine ninety nine, so I basically got that one for five bucks. I found these, which um, um, no, this is right. This is uh, these items right here shouldn't be on the table. I don't know how they got mixed up. This is, uh, I think that was TJ Maxx Ross or something like that. But I don't know how that got on the table. All right, so other toys I got is this uh, Star Wars, um, the Y-Wing Scout. This item was uh, nine, what was it, six ninety nine. So I basically got that for three dollars and fifty cent. So I'm going to call out the price and just know that everything was 50% off. This item right here, it wasn't even, um, it didn't even have a price tag on it. So the lady just 
bring it up for 50 cents and this is a bat uh batman and robin the night hunter robin um versus uh poison ivy and this is an old game i don't i mean uh toy but yeah they let me get that for 50 cent because it didn't have a, a price tag on it uh these are the um nintendo switch controllers the wired control the wired controllers um they was listed at $16.99 and um i paid half of that so what's that uh eight dollars i think it's uh eight dollars and fifty cents something like that um i got these nintendo switch carriers uh this is the donkey kong country version i paid uh they actually were selling these for 9.99 so this was five dollar buy purchased two of those i got this game right here uh Zomb zombieopoly oh 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 and um this game right here i have sold about five or six of these and they had it marked down to 5.99 and and that was the thing too even if you had the uh things that were marked in clearance it still were half off uh you had the ones that were regular price that were half off and things that had the red tag was half off as well uh these shoes here the puma uh sandals uh let's see these was 12.99 so half off of that i got some uh, adidas sandals i got these uh jelly bean dispensary um i think these was half off as well uh, along with the jelly bean i, I would actually just pick these to kind of bundle the uh jelly bean dispensary with the uh actual jelly beans these is uh $7.99, so uh, about $4 a bag. Only thing, though, they only had two of these, so I got to find another one uh, so that I can sell this third bag. But, yeah, I'm going to bundle this stuff right here and sell it on eBay. And that's what I need to mention, too. Uh, these shoes will be sold on eBay. Although I am approved for Puma on uh, Amazon, I don't know if I'm going to try to sell those sandals on Amazon. I just got to comp them and find out. The uh, Adidas, I'm not approved on Amazon, so I would definitely be selling those on uh, eBay. Nintendo, I am approved on Amazon. Star Wars, I'm approved on Amazon. I'm not sure about the puzzles. I got to check that out. Um, I got this little kitty, uh, what is this, the body wash or something like that? Um, yes, a body wash set for kids um this was on clearance for 5.99 so got that for three dollars i got two of those for lion king and one for um for four let me try to go through this stuff kind of quickly um so everything you see right here uh is pretty much uh baby bottles uh you know anything that has to do with uh breastfeeding um the nipples and stuff like this little thing right here it was uh regular price 4.99 i got it for half off and i think the i don't know i'm gonna show you the i'm gonna basically comp everything well not everything i'm gonna comp some of the things and this is one of the things i'm gonna comp just to show you what it go for on amazon uh and like i said this is an assortment of all different type bottles they have good uh returns so um i'm not going to show all of those because it's different version i can say this this item right here this is a uh this is what is this this is an insulated bottle bag now this item right here and this is for people that are trying to sell on amazon uh this right here you see the box damage uh that's a no-go for amazon uh, this item right here, I will try to sell it on eBay, but this one right here is definitely in Amazon shape uh, to sell. This was $9.99, half off of that. Like I said, this will be an eBay sale. Uh, pretty much I sell it as new open box. Um, these items right here, I was able to get six. You can sell them in a set of three. 
uh, and they was on clearance as well. They had the red tag for a dollar ninety nine cent, and so half of that would be uh, one dollar. Uh, these items right here they have called the uh, Baby Magic Common Bat uh, Baby Bath three forty nine. So half of that uh, they had a good comp as well, and. Um, some of the best buys that I had was these baby monitors. Uh, they was half off. So I think um, this one I paid $30 for. And this one I paid, this was $59. So that was $60. Bucks. So I paid $30 half off on each. So 50% off of the uh, Motorola one and 50% off the Baby Delight Um Found these headsets, the uh, PS4 uh, Expo 3. I have two sets of these. They was uh, $19.99 and I got them for basically 10 bucks each. Um, Ryan watches, I found two, uh, one blue one and one, I mean, uh, one red and one light blue. Uh, they was going for uh, $29.99. And so half of that was $15. They comp well. I found these little Spider-Man watches. Uh, they go for $9.99. So I got it for five bucks. Got three of those. They had three, I took all three. Now these, um, this is the Galaxy S8 uh, cover. I may keep one of these for myself because I have a Galaxy 8. They was going, they was marked down at 149. So pretty much uh, got these for 75 cents. They come well on uh, Amazon. I don't know what they do on eBay, uh, but I will come. Um, I got these uh, PlayStation uh, 3 controllers. Um, they are wired controllers. They were selling for $8.99. So basically, I got these for about $4.50. Uh, what else I got? I got these Jordans. Um, they was $44.99, half of that. So I got these. What is this? This is a uh, Bay Blaze. I think I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six of these and they were uh, $4.99, so half of that, so about $2.50 each. I picked up these little Charlie Brown cups where they got all the, the key characters from uh, Peanut in here. And um, I picked up three of those and they was going for $3.99, so basically $2. And I got this, uh, what is this, the Nightmare Before Christmas cup. I don't know if this is like a coffee cup, soup cup, or some type of cup, but it was $5.99, so basically got that for $3. I got these wall arts, um, the Spider-Man, look like it coming out of the doing picture. I got the uh, Marvel Avengers here with uh, Thor, um, Captain America, my dude, the Hulk. Iron Man, and I don't know if that's Black Widow or not, but yeah, I got that. Uh, this small one was $9.99, so half of that would have been five bucks, and this one was 29 so I got it basically for $15, and I think I forgot something over here. I got this jacket. This is uh, the, the uh, golfer from, uh, sorry about that, y'all. called a shark or something like that the land shark or yeah create the land shark from alabama <laughs> no george norman um and they had it marked down i think it was on clearance Let's see here there's the tag at? okay so they had it on clearance for uh 14.99 and uh, half off of that would have been about $7.50. It still had a tag, and this tag is at $99. So I'm gonna come and see what it do on uh, eBay. 
and um, go from there. I don't know if I'm going to set it for 99 but, you know, whatever it's coming for, that's what we're going to try to roll with it. I got these uh, Peppa Pig. This is a popular little toy for the little kids. They had three of these. Um, they had it for $5.99, so uh, basically I paid three bucks for those. Um, they had this little cup. Uh, but, uh, but, uh, Batman is standing goblet cup. They had it for $3.99. They had another one, but I left it. I should have went on and got it anyway, but the box was so beat up. Uh, and then I picked up these, uh, um, these Jordan outfits for infants. Now, when I first started selling on eBay, besides Barbies, this was the other thing that I uh, started with. I bought probably about $600 worth of this stuff. The booties and hats, the booties, the the uh, whole outfit uh, when I first got started because I just didn't know what to sell, but I was thinking about things that were popular and this wasn't the thing that popped in my mind and I could get it for a good price. So I went out and bought it and um, I ended up selling them all. So if you don't sell these and you're thinking about it, this is, this is a good investment. Um, and especially at uh, Burlington right now, uh, they got these for uh, pretty much $13, the whole suit. And I picked up the uh, red one, red and black, uh, the Jordan 23, black and gold, uh, jump man with all the shoes. Um, what else? I got the gray one with all the shoes. I think it's 12 shoes or something like that. I'm not, I'm not a big Jordan guy. Um, and then I have the, the, uh, black one. So yeah, I got all sorts of booties, different colors stuff. So, but yeah, these are, you know, you can make pretty decent money with those if you, uh, find the right ones and moving right along. I got the SOG bags. Uh, this is popular. I bought this. The first bag I bought SOG was from Ross and I paid about $35 for it and sold it on Amazon for 80. This particular one right here, I pay, I think, 15 bucks for. Uh, it was listed at $29.99, so basically pay about 15 bucks, and it comp well. Um, if you see over here in this corner, I have the uh, Paw Patrol 3-in-1 um, booster seat. That's already sold. I just listed that on Saturday, and I got to ship it tomorrow. I sh sold that on FBM uh merch for field with uh amazon i have two of the uh mini mouse uh those were running for uh basically 24 dollars so i got that basically got those for 12 uh the whole 12 each and the deluxe uh super seat by summer uh those was selling for i think 39.99 so i got and the uh the other deluxe summer up here at top was uh what that price 39.99 i think uh yeah so all of these was like 20 bucks half off and these was uh 12 bucks half off and then i got the adidas bags i sell these on amazon i've been on ebay uh i've been selling those for years that those, those are good money as well you can at least make half of your money back on those bags um let me see what else i have i'm gonna move over to the uh to the walmart stuff Okay, so um, everything you see here is from Walmart clearance. And this was from Saturday pickup. You see that guy in the back with the Steeler shirt on? That's my dude, Bob. Uh, Bob, keep people straight. I told a story about uh, one of my videos where uh, my neighbors came over one time to uh, see what was going on in my garage. And they seen Bob and, and almost took off because they thought Bob was for real. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, that's my dude, Bob. He, uh, my security guy. Um, so these are the items that I picked up from, uh, clearance. I have this Star Wars, um, commemorative, uh, set. I have two different sets. This one is, uh, Finn and, uh, Poe. And this particular one is, uh, Kilo, uh, Kylo and, uh, Ray. Um, so don't, they, 
also was hidden clearance. They had these listed as four, but they was $2 each. So I ended up getting four of those. Basically all they had. Uh, Spider-Man, uh, this was $3. And the uh, Ant-Man, I got those in clearance for $3. This Lego was five dollars. I found three more of these. The uh, Apple to Apple. This was one of the bolos that I gave out in uh, one of my videos last week. I found the frozen blanket. They had that listed at seventeen ninety eight. I mean, actually, it's a quilt. They had it listed at seventeen ninety eight, but in hidden clear, it was uh, listed at eleven dollars and twenty five cent. Uh, these items right here, the um, Harry Potter Magical One Series Two, um, they had these listed at five dollars in clearance. They were actually four, so I purchased about twenty of those. As you can see, I found these which uh, come pretty well. Um, the Harry Potter um, Riddles Diary. Um, this item right here comp well. They had this uh, selling for four dollars. Trying to find the price tag. Don't see the price tag on that one. Okay, so here it goes. Four dollars. Uh, and like I mentioned in one of my other videos, WWE. This guy right here, uh, Roman. If you see him, you want to buy this. No matter what it is for WWE. If you see this guy, this guy gonna make you either double or triple, or sometimes four times your money. He's actually the cousin of uh, the other wrestler that retired, The Rock. But yeah, if you see him out there, I mean, mostly any of the WWE, all of these items, like this is listed at 10, they was $5, uh, she was $5. Um, I don't know who she is. Uh, who is this lady? Um, what name is that? Sensational Sherry. I know some of you uh, wrestling fans out there know her. I left wrestling a long time ago. Uh, probably when I was about 15 to figure out that it wasn't real. Um, but yeah. Anyway, these uh, Godzillas, they uh, wasn't on clearance. But when I comped them, uh, they was at a price that I knew I could make a profit off of. So I bought them. I got two. They had two. I took two. Uh, Toy 4, I'm going to basically bundling her she was seven dollars i'm gonna bundle her with the sheets uh with the sheets was five dollars so i'm gonna bundle these two and once i i seen those comped already on uh on uh ebay and uh they comp well as a pair um uh, i don't know if you all can sell brothers on amazon but i can and i found these at fifteen dollars so i bought four they had four i bought I purchased all four. Uh, these two items right here, they was just sitting in the uh, female cosmetic section. And I just picked them up. This is uh, Dale Walker from Gears of War. And this is Jack Cooper from uh, Titanfall 2. And I took them to the cash register. Both of them ringed up at $1.50 each. So... Be on the lookout. If you see something sitting in clearance, not in clearance, but if you see something sitting in a section all by itself and it do, don't look like it belong there, scan it with the Walmart app, see what it go for. And um, this item right here definitely was out of place. So my mind quickly said, scan it, see what it go for. It came up on the app at $1.50, but still had to take it to the uh, register to make sure that was correct. Uh, this Fortnite uh, Jeep, the ATK all-terrain cart. Uh, I found this on clearance for nine bucks. I also found some more Fortnite stuff down here that was pretty cheap. Uh, found this, uh, what is this, uh, Shopkin Castle. It was going for $7. <clears throat> Uh, what else we have here? Oh, okay. I got Chewy, uh, Chewbacca from, uh, Star Wars. They was going at $3, even though the tag says four, they was selling at three and I got four of those and hold up. I'm almost, I didn't make the sheets fall. Okay. I found these, uh, fallout, uh, kits, little collector's kits. Um, 
They was listed at $11.18. They was $6 each. I got three of those. Sylvania lamps. I don't find these every time I go out and never get caught up. If you see these in the clearance, nine times out of ten, they either sell them for $7 or $4. You know, so make sure you scan these. Don't be afraid because you see the big uh, $24 up there. Scan it anyway with the Walmart app if you see those in clearance. And if they are in clearance, nine times out of ten, they are either nine, seven, or $4. And that's basically what I've been coming across every time I run into uh, Walmart. So yeah, I just wanted to kind of go over the things that I had uh, during my sourcing trip. Everything you see over here is from Burlington uh, on Friday sale. And everything you see over here is from clearance uh, on Saturday at one of my local Walmarts. So like I said, I was gonna uh, show you all uh, some of my items i have out here in the garage uh i have some more barbies behind those i have some um avenger characters i don't know if y'all can see that through these barbies let's see here yeah okay so probably can see death pool back there but i have several uh 12 inch marble figures back there as you can see i got my dude hulk up there dan knows uh i have i don't know how many of these um legends um i mean you can see them all the way in the back there then i have my jason i'm trying to get this shelf right here i got some more stuff in the back that i'm trying to get this whole two shelves full of my halloween stuff and uh this is just the beginning but i got so many of those uh figures and other halloween stuff i'm gonna fill these two shelves up some of this stuff here I showed you all on my last video. Uh, the Spider-Man and Venom and the WWE stuff and the Black Panther stuff. All that stuff right there. I mean, I got other shelves that I'm trying to get organized as well before I show that stuff. But just wanted to share that with you. That's, that's pretty much is the way I'm going to get everything organized in here. Um, and my other stuff is... To the right over here, my uh, FBM stuff, but I can't show that right now. Just can't do it, y'all. Just can't do it. All right, so, oh, yeah, this lamp is hot. <laughs> yeah, I sweated out my shirt, but, hey, I had to keep making the video. I mean, it is what it is. Make sure that you protect yourself when you're out. I know I'm not your dad. I'm just, you know, concerned. Put on your gloves, put your mask on, put your long sleeve shirt on. I know it's blazing outside, but still, you know, you want to take all precaution to protect yourself during uh, this event, um, situation, crisis, you know, because the thing is, is that at the end of the day, this stuff, you know, all the stuff that you see on these tables it is not worth your life. So make sure you protect yourself. Uh, and with that being said, Continue to support my channel. Please like and subscribe. Buffalo Picker, see you on the next video.